What's up, y'all? Before we get into this video, I want y'all to know I recently got into this office. Yes, it is an office. That's why it has a view, and that's why you see that I'm in a building. Now, I do have a office registry. If y'all can help and, you know, get a couple things on that list, I love y'all forever, okay? But um, God is great. I'm just happy that I was able to do so. I hope y'all do like the view. I have a couple things I need to get. Like right now, I'm frying right now. So put down in the comments the best portable air condition because I got to get one ASAP, okay? Um, but I appreciate y'all for always tuning in, man. And without y'all, I wouldn't have been able to do this. So I just want y'all to know I'm so grateful and so happy and so thankful. Um, the link will be in the pinned comment. And uh, yeah, y'all enjoy the video. What's up, y'all? Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into uh, Krishan Rock. Uh, she's about to go to jail for 30 days, uh, to be exact. And uh, let's get into it, because I know y'all love to say I'm biased and can't wait for me to be biased and all this other bull. Listen, for one, the last time I spoke about Krishan, Y'all was upset because I was speaking about Krishan and James. And basically, y'all was saying she should go to jail if she hit somebody. Absolutely. If you hit somebody, I feel like whatever is supposed to happen is supposed to happen. What I'm trying to tell y'all is we don't have no footage of it happening. That's all I'm saying. So whether you agree with me or not, I don't care. Um, that's where I was coming from, though. If you would stop the hate and just hear what I say, then maybe it would sound different. But... If uh, somewhere were to get hit, obviously, and I've been saying this, they should get whatever they're supposed to get. Once again, their story just did not do well, okay? Them telling the story as a collective was not well. Them falling out after the story was bad. They all fell out. So for y'all to go, you know, just kind of be on their side fully as if all of what they said was the truth. I can't agree with y'all on that either. So it is what it is. Feel how you feel. However, apparently she violated. Krishan Rock has a bench warrant for her arrest after violating her four year probation sentence and assaulting James Wright and Woe Vicky. So on the show, um, I don't even know how it's Woe Vicky because she did not touch Woe Vicky, but I guess the role that she played in it, um, it has something to do with that. Apparently, they have the um, the charges and all that, which I'm going to get into. But Hollywood Unlocked says, Krishan Rock has a bench warrant for her arrest after violating her four-year probation sentence and assaulting James Wright. Well, Vicky, she's ordered uh, for commitment of 30 days. Socialize what's your thoughts. Also, um, apparently, it had also has something to do with her not going to court. But I'm going to go to Hot Tea Hot Chocolate and see, because she actually has the um, the charges, the court papers, girl, whatever. So we're going to get into that. Now, once again, like I said, and I'm going to say it again, because for some of y'all can't hear in the back. If you put your hands on somebody, you have to pay the piper. So y'all see State of Oklahoma versus Krishan Malone. Now on 22324. Uh, the above entitled matter comes on for hearing as to defendants failure to complete 120 hours of community service by 9-15-2023 as ordered on 3-15-23. Violation of community service rules as follows. Failure to comply. The defendant has a remaining balance of 120 hours. The court, upon hearing the merits and review of files, finds the defendant failed, neglected, and refused to completely uh, uh, excuse me, complete community service according to the rules as ordered. It is therefore ordered that the defendant be committed to the custody of Sheriff of Craig County, Oklahoma, to be jailed for 30 days of flat time as previously ordered. So it's given she did not go to jail for what happened with her and Woe Vicky and or James. She's actually going to jail for not doing her damn community service. And that's just for right now because she about to be dealing with a lot more than that. My first question is, why the hell would you not do your community service, Krishan? And what bothers me about her is she's become, she thinks she's untouchable, you know? She thinks she's untouchable. She thinks she's unbreakable. And she thinks that she could do what the hell she want. And that's just not how life works. Um, so that's something she absolutely going to have to deal with. Now, her being in jail 
after that, because she has to go to court, if I am mistaken. She was supposed to go to court yesterday. If it ain't on the 23rd, it's the 27th. Um, so this says bench warrant, uh, APPL, whatever that means, to accelerate bench warrant failure to do community service. So she literally um, has to go to jail currently because she didn't go to community service. Just like she gets shows and don't show up to shows, I don't understand. It ain't for me to understand I can't believe she just be doing some of the shit that she be doing. Um, so, yeah, I wanted to speak about that. And, girl, let's look at these comments on Hollywood Unlocked. <clears throat> All right. So, Carlissa said, if it wasn't for the blood, <laughs> I tell you, Chocolate said 30 days isn't too shabby. Um, somebody said with both parents incarcerated, who will take care of the infant? That's the exact question that I have. That's the question I've been having since the beginning. What are y'all going to do about junior and Carlissa? If it in my blood, you about to be the one that's the runner up to get them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She definitely is. I don't know what she celebrating. Krishan's mom is not, she has zero stability. Her mother is not getting junior. So I just want to put that out there. The godparents, I'm not sure how that works because I think that the first person that would, you know, get custody or whatever over um, the child would be the grandparent. And Carlissa is looking like the more stable grandparent. I mean, even the the father, Blueface's father, um, he's staying with Blueface. So... I don't know in the court of law if that will offer stability. You know, some of y'all lawyers in here, y'all could tell me what's going on. Um, she went on IG Live and said, I'm not worried about no lawsuits because I'm covered and clearly not bucko. <laughs> Showing her address is crazy, which I completely agree. Y'all believe anything. I still feel like it was a setup. She messed up by not having a team. Them people was way too old to be trying to be around her. Now, where I was coming from with that, because y'all still don't get it, Tamar had zero, and I'm talking zero, um, reason, reasons to have Krishan at that show. If she wasn't performing, why am I there? I don't even listen to your music. Why am I there to support it? I'm, I'm sorry. I do not hear, I do not see or hear Krishan bumming to Long Way Home. I don't. I don't. Hell, I probably didn't even know who Tony Braxton was. Okay. So I call Cap. I absolutely feel like I don't think it was a setup. I'm not going to say it was a setup, but I'm going to just say something about it ain't right at all. Now, did anybody think that Krishan would punch James in the face? Of course not. But did anybody think that they might have pissed her off knowing the hothead that she is? Absolutely. I wouldn't put it past them, especially the shit show that they had after it all happened. Like, I get y'all don't want me to be on Krishan's side, and that's fine. Um, but if you want me to be on the side of all of the 40-plus people, and I mean 40-plus in age people who completely showed they ass after this whole situation, yeah, I'm not on their side either. So if that's the case, I'm just not on anyone's side. Like, how is it that something like this happened, the first person that comes to the internet, 40 plus, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? I haven't even filed a police report yet. What are you doing? After that, it comes out that he too was bullying James. How is that credible? You're bullying James as well? For what? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? After that, Tamar, she don't even count. Tamar's other friend, manager, whatever, came out, said what happened, but he also said it was only a couple people in the room. The other guy, I can't even think of his damn name, um, the one who originally put it out, uh, he said it was 40 people in the room. Krishan came in there with her 12 friends, blah, blah, blah. Okay? I'm not going for it. Not going for it. Not on their side. Not at all. Am I on Krishan's side? If, Like I said, if she hit that man, completely wrong. Period. So to be on the, shot, on the side of the shit show, y'all have at it. It don't sound no better than Krishan's side. Sorry. Um, that's what I have to say about that. This whole debacle is a mess. I wish 
God knows. I wish Krishan had a better, um, had a better, I don't know, team of people. And I even mean older people, her family, that could um, be a better role model in the situation because you, she don't have one, gang. She out here just doing whatever she want to do. And she also is, um, she has some of the actions of her other siblings and it just so happened they're not rich, though. So here we are with that. Y'all let me know what y'all think about all of this down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Do what you will, do what you will with it. Okay? Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Yeah, yeah.